Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Come it like a cherry. Come it like a cherry. Your boy done switched up on you. Come it like a cherry. Wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys look, if this is your very first time on this channel, y'all go on over there and subscribe for me. And after you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell beside the word subscribe so that you'll be notified each and every time we upload a video. And then welcome to this great family. Now that you're part of this family and you're going to join us with these good eats, there's something else we want you to join us doing, okay? And we do it every day because it helps us grow. Those things are comment, comment, Come it like a share and go for the team. Come it like a share and go for the team. Come it like a share and don't forget to come it like a share. Come it like a share. Come it like a share. Don't forget to come it like a share. Come it like a share. Come it like a share. Don't forget to don't get to come it like a share. Okay, you guys, check this out. We're going to go ahead and pray and we're going to get into the goodness. Here we go. Hey, man, how y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? I'm going to go ahead and let you know right now so I don't have to stop again, okay? Big Ben is in the building, baby. Big Ben is here. Big Ben is in to help us out, y'all. Let's see if he's nice and refreshing. Mm. 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 Yes, he is. Okay, guys, today, y'all, we ain't got nothing but some king crab, we got some sauce, and we got some cucumbers, lemons, and lime. That's all we got, y'all. Now, let's get to eat, because we done prayed, we done prayed, we done prayed. Y'all, let's get it. Okay. Let me take this here down from here. Y'all got sauce all in this one. Mmm, mmm. Okay, y'all. Now, I've got a confession to make first. I have got a confession to make first. Before we get started. Well, we'll get started on our vinegar and salt from Buffalo Wild Wings and our cucumbers. Okay, you guys. Let me tell you something. Y'all. Mm. I just made this sauce, y'all. And honey, I put so much cayenne in the sauce. Now, y'all, I don't know what this is going to be like, but I know while I'm gone, when I tasted it, baby had me sneezing. It had me sneezing. So, we're going to hope that we can get through this here. We're going to hope, y'all, and pray. We're going to hope and pray, y'all. Oh, y'all got the old bay over here to the side and the lips hot sauce. But as y'all can see, baby, it ain't even no jalapenos up here. This sauce is hot. Y'all, it's hot. I ain't lying. Uh, it's hot. Mm -hmm. It's real hot. Y'all eat so much cayenne and red peppers in here. And it's just a sauce, y'all, that I just threw together. <clears throat> just got a bunch of seasons out and threw it together. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Ooh. Here we go. First bite. Mmm. 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 -hmm. It's good, though. Mm -hmm. So y'all, today, I said, I'm just going to go eat some crab. I just want some crab. I did. Let's get some old bay from over here too, y'all. Let's get some old bay. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to sprinkle just a little taste, just a little taste. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Y'all, this is good. It's good. 
Mm-hmm. I'm putting some lime on it. Mmm. 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 So, anywho, how y'all doing today? Mmm. Y'all, this is a piece of the knuckle meat right here. I'm going to throw it to the side, mm. y'all. To, to make sure that's out of my way. I ain't got no space up here, y'all. Mm. We probably get to an eat, though. Like guess. Mmm. Ah. Uh, yeah, it's good. That's good. When I was getting ready, I remember last time when I ate, um, what was I eating? Oh, King Crab. Duh. The last time, y'all, when I was eating King Crab, uh, somebody told me in the comments was like, I really want to see you eat one of them knuckles. So today, I knew I was hungry, y'all. I knew I was hungry. So I said, well, today, I'm just going to, you know what I'm saying, put some claws up there. But y'all know I had to have a leg or two. I had to have a leg or two. And then these here was kind of small, too. They was a little small. The king crab was. That was a little small, y'all. Mmm. Compared to the one we normally have. Mm-hmm. So I said I'm gonna put them up there. But before I get to eating good, I'm gonna get into one of them cows. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Y'all but it's good. Mmm. And like I said. I just want some crab. I want king crab. Hubby wants snow crab. So, D ladies, I cooked him some snow crab. So, guess what? I cannot deal with y'all in the comment. Tell me I cook Hubby some, honey. He had snow crab. He didn't want king crab. He did not want king crab, y'all. So, anywho. Uh. But I wanted some king crab. I did, I did, I did. And I didn't want to be mixed up with potatoes and corn and broccoli and sausages and this and that and that and this. I didn't want to deal with none of that. Oh. Oh. I didn't want to deal with any of it. I didn't. I didn't want to deal with any of it, y'all. None of it. Zero. None of it. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Y'all is soft. It's got so much red pepper and cayenne in honey. It's hot. Then I put the two times spicy sauce. Then I put the two times spicy sauce in there too. It's hot. All right, y'all. We're going to get one of these. And see what it's talking about. Mm-hmm. Mm. mm. Y'all didn't get nothing out of there. There's a little piece of shell. Protecting the meat. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Y'all, the clouds be hard to get in sometimes. The clouds be hard to get in sometimes. Then the skin crab, baby, will stick you so bad, it'll set your soul on fire. I ain't lying with you. The skin crab, these little things on them will set your soul on fire, honey. You mess around and get in, get in too deep. Well, you at the point of no return. And you squeeze it on that junk and see what happens. This king crab will let you know. He's a king of the sea. And he means not to be messed with. And that includes you. 
Well, in this case, me. <laughs> Y'all, this why this why I'm fell in love with D shell. So you ain't got to do all this, huh? Well, I would have to do it anyway. So when I do D shell, hubby do the D shell it. So I would have to do it anyhow. Come on, we gotta get in here to it though, y'all. I think I'm cutting the meat up now, y'all. Huh? I think I just cut the meat up. I did. Cut my meat up, y'all. I cut my meat up, y'all. I did. Mm-hmm. Mm. Um. Mm hmm. That sounds good, though. It's made with some of that good old high price butter, honey. Huh? Is this why y'all want to see me declaw? See me up here struggling? Uh. I'm gonna dig to me like this, junk. I ain't even worried about y'all. I'm just gonna dig to me like it. It ain't giving me no big old piece of meat like the leg, do no way. Mm hmm I'm just gonna dig it out of there. Mmm. 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 There's meat in there, though. Yes, it is. There is meat in there. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Oh. So. Oh. Mm -hmm. So what are your plans for this good fine day? Do you have any? Or are you just kind of laying around? Uh, you guys, I found us two little adorable seafood places here in Memphis that we're going to try. You know, I think that it don't matter what it is. If I ain't got to cook it at home, it'll probably. Mm. Well, I guess I shouldn't say that. I guess I should just say, I'm ready to try somebody else's seafood. Put it like that. I'm ready to try somebody else's seafood, y'all. Let's see if we can get in there. Mmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Y'all, the meat is up. Oh, there's some right there. Yeah. There's some right there. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Y'all, I was really concerned mm -hmm. about the amount of spice that was in the sauce. Because, y'all, I just went to the barber shop today. So, all of my you know, everything around my lips and everything, it's just been cut. And y'all, when I tell you that my mouth is burning, baby, my mouth is burning. It sure is. It's burning, y'all. Y'all, this him is not working for me. It's not working for me. Uh, Y'all just don't want to cooperate. Come on now. Come, okay. Well, give me something. Mm, give me something. Give me something. Give me something. Give me something. I done went through all that. Now give me something. This still ain't going to give me to you. It just ain't going to let me be great, y'all. It ain't going to let me be great. Well, it may. Hold on, y'all. Hey, it let me be great. It, uh oh, -uh. no, I don't want that. It let me be great, y'all. It ain't that much fat on it. It let me be great. I don't even know if you can see that. Hey, I don't even know if you can see that, honey. Okay, y'all, we're gonna get into the conversation. Oh. Mmm, 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 mmm. 
Y'all, the devil is out of trouble. Mm-hmm. The devil is out of trouble. But for that meat, y'all. But anyhow, mm, y'all know the cucumber. But don't never let us down. And not as long as you got this bubble of wild wings, y'all. Mmm. This is good. Now, y'all, this is what I want to talk about today. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all, let's talk about. Ooh. Ah! Let's talk about. Ooh, hold on, y'all. I got to pay attention while I'm trying to get in this crab, honey. Because, baby. I told y'all, this crab will punish you, baby. This crab will punish you if you disrespect it. This crab will punish you, honey. And you ain't gonna leave it alone because you want the meat. Ah! You want the meat, honey. So you just keep on going and fighting with it. Okay, then that came out pretty easy. Then that came out pretty easy. Okay. Okay, y'all. Y'all, I want to talk about self-worth or self-belief. Either one, I'm going to be fine. They both really the same thing to me, for me. Is that what I want to talk about? Do you know Mm. Yeah, there's some crab in there. Y'all seen it, didn't you? Y'all even went way over there across the room. You know you're on the right channel, baby. You know you're on the right channel. <laughs> y'all, it's way over yonder. It's way over yonder, honey. But I'll just say, y'all, do you know your self worth? Do you know? how valuable you are to this world. Do you know at this very moment, right now, if you're listening to me, there is no way, there's no way, because God got you here for a reason. God, if you here, it's because God still got some work for you to do. And if that's the case, you've got to know your self-worth, y'all. You've got to know your self-worth. You have got to know that this world, if you're still here and God has use for you, this world couldn't run without you. Hey! Did you hear that? Now let me go back and tell you again so that you get it this time one more again, okay? So that you can get it. If God has you still here, it's because he has a purpose for you to be here. And this world couldn't run without you. It couldn't. It could not run without y'all. Without you. It can't run without you. Not long as God got you here, in order for the world to be balanced and work the way that God intended to, it can't run without you. You are worth just as much to this earth and God's all body and divine plan as anybody else on this earth, y'all. I'm serious, y'all. Y'all just don't know how many DMs, how many emails that I get where people tell me they want to start YouTube, but they don't think people will accept them. They don't think that, you know, some people just come right out and say, mm, mm. some people just come out and say, which prompted me to do this video or this conversation. They just come out and say, I just don't think 
you know, that I'm worthy or I just don't think that because this is wrong with me. I had one person told me they can do YouTube and so they got their mouth fixed. That was <laughs> y'all it ain't funny. <laughs> but it is. And they said they could not start a YouTube channel until they got their mouth fixed. You know what I told them? Well, let me tell you this. You must not watch very much YouTube. Because, baby, it's a whole lot of folks on YouTube who mouth is tore up from the floor. Okay. Okay. And they're going right about their business. Because they understand that their self-worth is more than teeth. It's more than what other folks, other folks, What other folks say is beautiful. Because if you're on a social media platform, such as YouTube, if you're on a social media platform, then you're putting yourself, your life, your time, your person out there for the world to see, like or dislike, but definitely for them to scrutinize and tell you what's wrong with you. So what they try to tell you. They try to tell you what's wrong with you, but you can't see them. But what I'm telling you is, know your self-worth. Know your self-worth. And then you ain't got to worry about it. Whether it be for YouTube, whether it be to go to the laundromat, whether it be whatever. Know your self-worth. And like I said, know that this world, oh, glory. This whole world could not work the way that God intended it. If you weren't here, you are an important part to God's divine plan. If you still here, if you still here, it's because he got work for you to do. No matter what it is, we all came here and we all got a purpose. Every one of us that had a birthday, we got an expiration date too. Every one of us. Mm. But baby, what I can tell you for sure, y'all, know your self-worth. And whatever time that God leave you here for, you make sure that you live it to the best of your ability, your way. You hear me? You hear me? Your self-worth, if you grow, your own self-worth gives you the right. And I'm just trying to give you the want to live your life to the fullest. And stop worrying about other folk. You got to stop worrying about other folk. Uh-huh. You going to worry them. You going to worry about them higher. And your whole life going to be a pass you by worrying about other folk. But if you know your own self-worth, you ain't worried about what them other folks think about you. You ain't worried about it. Mm. Excuse my French, y'all. But I had an uncle. For real. I had an uncle that had an old saying, y'all. And excuse my language. Oh. Woo! Y'all, this good. I was holding this cucumber, but I want it. But anyway, I had an uncle to have saying, y'all. I'm going to tell you what it was. Like I said, excuse my friend. But you say all the time, I ain't got my ass on you. <laughs> hey! For real! I don't. You know what I'm saying? My uncle used to say that all the time. He sure did. He sure did, honey. He did. Because folks will do what? Keep you miserable. Keep you insecure. So they can feel better about them own selves. And get what? They still going to find something else to talk about. They are. So you might well. Oh, you might well have lived your life like you wanted to. Oh, y'all, hold up. I forgot I got this. 
claw meat over here. I got this claw meat, y'all. I forgot about this. I'm going to eat it. I am. I ain't in no rush to be trying to get into the other claw. I am not. Bro, them claws are hard to get into. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> that sauce got in my throat. Mm-hmm. So know your self-worth, y'all. For real. Know your own self-worth. That way you ain't got to be worried about other folks' approval about you. You don't. Mm-hmm. I was kind to tell somebody. Family, friends, or whatever. Well, you get too deep in my business. I got this. That's what I tell them. I got this. I got this. Y'all, you can grab me good. I know one thing. Whoever eat that other claw is not going to be me. I cannot. Nope. Y'all, I do not want to be digging. Trying to get that meat out of y'all. I don't want to do it. Y'all, we may have a part two to this video. I was so hungry. And so worried about this sauce. But I can't get the whole conversation out like I wanted to. But that's all right. You get it for now. Know your own self-worth. Don't depend on nobody to tell you what you worth. You know what you worth. You really, really do Baby, you better use what you got and move on. Whatever God granted you with, he gave you all the tools that you need to succeed. Okay. Oh, he did. Ooh. Ooh. I think it's a little shell on there, y'all. I'm dropping the meat. Um. Oh. Mm -hmm. Y'all just been a little messy boots today. I ain't washed my hands and nothing. That's all right. Do y'all get the picture though? All those aside, do y'all get the picture though? You get it? You got to know your own step worth. So that you don't be looking for validation from others about what that worth is. Because they don't give you the worth that you think that you're supposed to have. Then you're upset. Uh-huh. When you could have set the boundaries yourself. And know your own self-worth. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Right now. Uh. Y'all ain't eating that cloud. Nope. Y'all, it may be a part two of this video. Because I don't think I got my thought out like I wanted to. But. Anywho, I think you got the picture of what I'm trying to say. Don't just... <laughs> yeah, that was good. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I really, really do. I hope you have enjoyed. And like I said, if you have self-esteem problems or you don't know your own self-worth, y'all, sit down. Get within yourself. Or take a vacation by yourself. You know what I'm saying? Do something really, really nice for yourself. Get in tune with yourself. So that you ain't looking for validation from other people. Because when you look for validation from other people, baby, you're going to be miserable. Because people, folks, folks ain't going to never let you be happy. They're going to try their best. They best. To make sure that you ain't happy. Remember now, the devil came to steal, kill, and destroy. Don't let other folks destroy mm, you and what you think about you. You know what you were. Devil, yeah, you ain't got to worry about it. Y'all finna go. I'm finna go, I'm finna go, I'm finna go. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Like I said, y'all, I don't know if we're going to do a part two or not. I don't know. When I end it back, I know, for real. 
because I know whether or not, you know, if I express myself well enough for you to get to where I was trying to get in the conversation. But anyway, to all my new legion, I thank you guys so, so much for being here. I love each and every one of you guys. Me and my legion want to say welcome, welcome, welcome. We love each and every one of you guys. Because you could have been in there way else in the world. But you chose to be here with us. And we love you for it. So I'm existing Lee Jam. I ain't going to play with you today. You know I love you. Y'all finna go, okay? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys look. Always remember that there's always more than one way home. All you got to do is get there. So get there, people. Get there. I love you all. And I'm going to see you guys next time. And if you're not here to watch me next time, you... <laughs> have lied to me and I know you lied period <laughs> bye bye mwah oh bye bye mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Wait, can grab a good I wanted to heat up all the snow. I could use a little of that. Look, y'all. I don't know if I got out what I was trying to get out during the video. I don't know. I got to wait till I end it back. But before I leave out of here, I'm going to give you the just in a nutshell, just in case I don't want to do part two. You guys, look. Know your self-worth. Know your self-worth. Because if you look for validation from other people in order to in order to build your self-worth, you guys, you're going to be miserable. No matter how much you try to live up to other people's standards, you never will. You never will. Because they had expectations of what you should be or what they want you to be. How they want to hold you under them. If these people are being negative towards you, because you there's a lot of good people in the world. But what I do know is good, bad, ugly, crippled, crazy. If you know your own self-worth, it don't matter what they got to say. It don't matter. Because you're not looking for that validation. You see what I'm saying? So, I think I just tipped it again. I still don't think I got it out. Y'all, it's in my heart, but I can't get it out right. Anyway, y'all, I'm finna go. I'm finna go. I'm so sorry. If you didn't get the point, I apologize. I hope I did get it out. But if you didn't get the point of it, I apologize. But just know this. If you didn't get nothing else. Love yourself. Love yourself. And know what you worth to this earth. Because it couldn't run as efficient as it does. It would be God's plan. His divine plan. If you weren't here. If you're here, he has a purpose for you. He has a purpose for you. And the world wouldn't run without you. I love you guys so, so much. You guys are so important to me. I'm going to see y'all tomorrow, okay? Bye-bye.